What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Fortnite video and within this video we will talk about possible Season 5 clues, leak challenges and much more. But before we do all of that guys, I am giving away 2800 V-Bucks every single week. To win, make sure you are subscribed to this channel and have that bell button ticked. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Winners are picked towards the end of the week and contacted via direct message here on YouTube. So good luck everybody. Okay, so the other day I read a Forbes article which spoke about what Season 5 with Fortnite Battle Royale could possibly entail. Now, obviously we only have clues in-game to go off, uh, so this is completely speculation. Nothing has been confirmed by Epic at all. Now, reading through the Forbes article though, I saw some interesting theories which I believe would indeed be great. So season 4 has not long started, we are basically heading towards, we're heading into the second week now but many interesting things are within the Battle Royale game map and which could indicate things to come in the future. With season 3 we had the addition of the Meteor, many speculated as to what this might be and what might happen. Although we weren't exact with details until the very end of Season 3, we knew deep down this Meteor would have an impact on the map and change things up for Season 4. And we were right. That is what's happened with Season 4. And this Meteor hitting the map, we have seen many, many changes to the map itself with the addition of this superhero theme. That is what's happened with Season 4. And with this Meteor hitting the map, we have seen many, many changes to the map itself, which with the addition of this superhero theme, could make sense in the future when you look at a bigger picture of what could possibly be coming. So we won't see another meteor that's for sure, but certain things found around the map, like the meteor, could impact us going into another season. So we now have what many are calling a superhero theme, although we don't have any backstory into how this has come to be. I mean we had a meteor hit the map and now we have a superhero theme. Now has a superhero theme been confirmed by Epic Games as to what this season is based on? I don't recall that, but hey. So what clues are found around a map which could come into play later on down the line? Well many clues point towards a superhero and supervillain conflict and this could start a whole different host of different things. On the map we have a hero base found under a mansion near Lonely Lodge and one on a mountain near Snobby Shores which is shaped like a school which is no doubt the villain's lair. But if we take a look inside this villain's lair, we can see a giant rocket. Now this rocket is not interactive as of yet. If Epic plan to make it so within the future, that would be interesting. But sticking to the theory, could this rocket or missile be used in a future battle between the heroes and villains? Will it shape the future of the map? Maybe the villains are planning to strike something in the near future which will change a certain part of the map. Or this rocket they plan on riding into outer space, which could start the space theme many thought would come with season 4. That's interesting to think about. Now the only problem I see with this rocket, if it is planned on hitting the map, is the fact it would act a lot like the meteor did in hitting the map. A bit too alike in my opinion to be something a whole new season is based on. But I do however think we might see this rocket coming to play in the future, maybe a part of some limited time game mode. We will just have to wait and see people, we really will. Something else really interesting found on the map is this dinosaur's footprint. When I say dinosaur, it could be a monster of any sort, but it reminds me of that T-Rex footprint from Jurassic Park. Now this has sparked much interest as to what this might mean. Many believe it could be a part of a movie set we see being added to Moisty Meyer, but that movie set is still being built up. This dino footprint looks to have taken out this house with it. And to be honest, you can't really see it unless you take a look from above in replay mode. When playing normally, it just looks like a meteor struck the earth like we see all over the map. So could this be a clue into what might be coming with season 5? Imagine interactive monsters on the map or an interactive monster which will hunt and kill you. I mean, this isn't far-fetched if you've played the Save the World game mode, which is full of crazy monsters of all sizes. Plus, the interactive features we have seen on the map ain't new. Just like the meteors we saw towards the end of Season 3, striking the map and destroying bases and so forth. And monster also seeking that centre circle isn't that far-fetched if you think about it. It could possibly be an indication into Season 5, but in my opinion at the moment it's just a little too early to make such a call. Now me personally, I think what's been mentioned today, unlike Forbes trying to tie it into Season 5, I think these may impact our current season. If you follow KL Smith on Twitter, who is the community manager of Fortnite, he tweeted out this the other day, have a look. 
There is still so much coming in season four of Fortnite. Huge grin on my face every day in anticipation of community reactions. Does he know future changes coming which will impact us and the game? Heck yes he does. Will any of these changes be of something mentioned today in this video? Well it's possible, but to say for sure would be misleading and my name isn't Allie. So he is excited to see our excitement. I think special things are planned. Whether or not the clues found on the map are clues at all though, we just don't know. And it's all just basically fun speculation. Now if any other news does come guys, as per usual, I have you covered here on my channel. If you want to check out what Forbes wrote about Season 5 and these clues, you'll find that linked within the video description also. Now we are going to move on and before we end the video, we have week 2 of Season 4's challenges. If you are interested, here they are. Search chests in Greasy Grove, you need to search 7 chests. Consume 7 hot blocks. Deal damage with suppressed weapons to opponents, 500 in total. Dance in front of 7 different film cameras. Search between a scarecrow, pink hot rod and a big screen. Explosive weapon eliminations and eliminate opponents in tomato town. So some fun challenges coming this Thursday. And as always guys, I will have guides on challenges that need them. So if you are new around here and don't want to miss another Fortnite video I post, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification button. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps me out people. And on that note, I am out myself. Thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.